Hey guys, it's Sasuke here, and welcome back to Nuclear Throne. Oh, I'm excited! The weekly is up! So, I think we should probably do the daily, then the weekly. Random. Eyes again! What is up with eyes today, man? Now, I haven't practiced any Nuclear Throne today, so I'm not expecting the best run, but I have been playing some Isaac, and I played, you know, I had one meh run, and then I had one good run, so... Maybe we can mimic those uh, results, because I'd be happy with at least one good run. Right click, right click, right click. Your right click on eyes allows you to use telekinesis, which attracts things to you, of course. And it also pushes away bullets, which is pretty damn nice. As you can see, this demonstration right here. We can kind of manipulate the enemies Ooh. into our area via attracting. Or just pull them into you know that that's also the smart way of doing it. But yeah, you normally don't use it to attract enemies to you. you mostly use it to push bullets away. As you can see how far they actually like arced away from us there. That's normally what you use it for. But there are some occasions, like if you're using a melee centric run with uh, extra reach or something, long arms rather. Which I was kind of hoping we could find to do that because it's one of my favorite runs. But so it takes care of face and uh. Oh my god, my brain just died. Scare your face and enemies, apparently. Let me kill this guy before we keep talking, or it's just not gonna happen. I really want this XP. I really don't like this position. And that was scary. But it worked. So if there's a double disc gun if we're uh feeling a little crazy. I, I will continue talking on the things we want in just a second. My brain is not going to handle this well. Okay. So, what? Oh my god, what was I even saying? My brain literally died. Was I talking about attracting weapons? <laughs> what was I talking about? Oh my god, I don't even know. I Guys, I, I forgot. It's, it's happened. My brain died. Yes, give me the early back muscle. Oh. I think I was hoping for um, long arms so we could use our melee weapon a bit more effectively. Because one of the nice things about long arms is you can attract people over like walls and stuff. Hello. <laughs> you can attract people over walls and then hit them through the wall with your melee weapon, which is pretty damn convenient. Now, there is. Nice chance here to do this. We get to go to pizza time, boys. What kind of time is it? It's pizza time. Hunger. Question mark? Give me some pizza. No pizza? But I need it. So, these guys are actually two hits. Grenade launcher again? <laughs> I mean, I don't want it, but thank you. Whoa. I was like, whoa, whoa. I'm a little, I'm a little scared of what's happening right now. There's where everybody died. We didn't get the XP sadly. Oh. Alright, I need to play a bit smarter here. Don't, don't melee snipers. They explode. It's a bad, it's a, it's a bad thing. So what is like? Oh, that melee though. He couldn't even think how fast I hit him in the mouth. Boom! Impact wrist, baby. Can't lie, it is probably my favorite mutation of all time. We're gonna focus on using our uh, melee weapon right now because we need to conserve ammo for the big dog fight. Wasting too much would be a massive mistake. I do want to make sure we don't die to stupid stuff like cars, though, so... Any chance we get, we're probably gonna smack the car out of the way. Oh! Thought it was gonna explode. Toxic bow is not what we want. We got extra bullets, though. So, I'll take it. Steroids can be oiled. So, this is gonna be clear out mostly via bullets right now. Okay, 
Big Dog has awoken. Nothing's up here behind us, so we can just focus direct by him for a minute. You gotta be careful with the bullets, you can track them in yourself without even knowing. Hey, he's done. We used a whole lot of ammo for it, but I think I'm okay with it. Heavy grenade launcher is probably gonna be better than this, but I think the laser pistol might be even better. I think I'm gonna go with the heavy grenade launcher though. As long as we take it low and slow, we should be 100% fine. Probably trigger fingers here. It's gonna be a little bit better than anything else, I think. Mostly because it can help us right now. Okay, we're good. Now here comes the low and slow part. We're gonna go out of our way to do everything a little slower than we normally would. Mostly because we don't have the weapon to really be doing it fast right now. Okay. Had to make sure he wasn't the bad guy before we walked into him. Because we can use all this ammo, really. There we go, we got plenty of bullets. We're just kind of biding time. We need um, the bullet mutation for this to really become viable. We also would love to have better accuracy right now. I don't know where that shot went, so I'm kind of cowering until it disappeared. Okay, disc gun. The nice thing is, this is an extremely strong weapon for this part of the game. Oh, that was so scary, I could have just killed myself. Luckily we did not, but it could have happened. Oh, we got a lot of bullets, it's fantastic. Lucky shot's probably what we're going to go here. I really need bloodlust, I need a bullet mutation, and I need them like yesterday. We're kind of hoping our explosives make a pretty good impact here on the population. Ooh, and that's what we were looking for. Multiple kills like that. Scary. First we need this XP. Then we need this XP. Kind of had to right click a little bit there. As scary as it was to attract those guys to us, I think it was a better idea than trying to make that risky dodge. The eraser. Not a bad one. We got more explosives, which we were kind of in need of. I heard that. Nicely done. We're level 7. Um. This is the true scary part. Triple machine gun, so much fun! probably could have. I definitely took some damage I didn't want to there, but I don't know how much avoiding could have been done. We got some HP there. We exploded the guy that was an immediate threat. We're back to full HP. We have a little bit of Not enough to really feel comfortable with it yet, but we're getting there. Oh, that sucked. I didn't think he was going to hit me. I thought we were going to come with our triple machine gun spray there. Double flame shotgun, it might have to replace our explosives here. I don't know. Oh, I'm getting real nervous. The explosive weapon is doing fantastically, though. The nice thing is impact rest on this level. Goodies, man. Did some pretty good payouts, though. All things considered. 
Got plenty of XP here too. Lots of XP, lots of goodies. Let's go check down this hallway. What's down here? Ah, it's nothing. Damn, I was really hoping for some good. So, there's still a chance for all the mutations that we want and need. Eagle Eyes is something that we definitely want. Bloodlust is something we want. What would be more important to us? Probably the Bloodlust, sadly. I love Eagle Eyes, but I think we're going to need the HP more eventually. I took this decision before knowing that there were, there was a minigun here, actually. That was pretty damn close, not gonna lie to you. Oh, that sucked. Got caught on the corner there. Assault rifle gonna give us a little bit of ammo, at least. Alright, this is risky as crap. Gotta be careful. Okay, we got some HP back. Actually, we got back to full HP. That's fantastic. I just held right click there and hope that we dodged the shot and we actually did. We're gonna push out here. Mostly trying not to die, but we need to grab this XP as well. Push that away, that's the end, but I think there is an ammo chest, or at least a weapon chest. Blood cannon. No, not what we needed. I'm nervous, man. I'm real nervous. We don't have what we really need. Eagle Eyes is great, but it's not the. still not what we need. This will give us enough ammo to maybe kill the Theron. Double minigun? <laughs> We're having enough trouble holding on to one, buddy. Thank you. Um. We'll just, we'll see how it goes. I'm, I'm a little nervous, I'm a little nervous. I'm sweating a little bit, just a little bit, because it's frickin' freezing. The nice thing is, we can hold right-click for most of this fight. As long as he's not walking towards us, we can hold right-click and push stuff away. But the second he starts walking, you have to let go of that right-click, or he'll corner you in the heart. It doesn't look like we can push the beam anymore, which is a little interesting. There we go, we should get a double hit now here. That's really good. Shot down the middle. I think we're gonna use a little bit of minigun here to speed this process up. We just need to hit it from the edge. There. So we just hold right click at the end here to survive. I don't think we have the the ammo to really do this next fight easily anyway. So I need to spam a little bit here to survive. Okay. We need to lead our shots a little bit. Oh my god, that was scary. Oh! It's so easy for these things to F you. Oh, we're empty. Oh, I shouldn't have went for that HP. God, we didn't get our bullet mutation the whole time, and we had the freaking minigun we should have swapped. Well, damn. We got 309, which, I mean, with six hours left, that's pretty much probably where we're going to be secured. I'm still not happy about it, but at least we got somewhere. Oh, wow, somebody got a good chicken run. Wow. Of course, you're going to see a lot of the uh, good characters up there. But chicken is kind of rare, man. Not not a lot of people get too far with chicken. Look at this. Look at this. Melon slice. 1-3 and loop 10. You heard me. Loop 10. Now, kind of... I was expecting to see... Our, uh... Our boy up here. I don't see him, though. 
Let's, we'll look into 50. Okay. No, he's not here. That's gonna do it for days. Or is it gonna do it? It's only 15 minutes. Who's the weekly? This plant. Oh, the plant. Um, it's only 15 minutes, but yeah, I'm just gonna cut it there. We'll we'll hit up another video with the weekly. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. If you guys liked it, hit that like button. It lets me know that you guys are enjoying the series and all that good stuff. Leave a comment down in the comment section below. Let me know whatever it is you need me to know. I read and respond to every single one. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. Recommend it to anybody who may be interested. And I hope you guys have the most amazing day in the whole damn world. See you guys.